bright enough? Uh-huh. How you feeling right now? Oh, mixed emotions. <laughs> uh, well, good morning, folks. Uh, welcome to day one of the Georgia Bass Trail here on Lake Eufaula. Woo. Um, it's a little chilly this morning. Um, as y'all, if y'all see the practice, I watched the practice video. Um, we didn't catch a whole lot. We spent a whole lot of time looking all over this lake for just some clean water, and then we found some, and we couldn't get no fish to bite. So we did catch one out of the muddy water on like a spinner bait. So I think that's what we're gonna go throw this morning. Who knows? Um, we might try a little popping frog or something. Like that. I mean, there's just we had a horrible practice. Uh, that's just plain simple. We had a horrible practice. Didn't catch all much, caught like maybe three. I mean, usually we win practice, like Justin catches a five, five pounder in practice, and um, that didn't happen this time. So, uh, <laughs> so either uh, we're gonna have a really horrible tournament, or we're gonna have a really good one, or it's just gonna be horrible for everyone. But typically, that don't happen with the Georgia Bass Trail. Uh, so, someone usually catches them. Um, Based upon conditions, probably going to take about 16, 17 pounds a day to win, I would think. Um, don't really know. I mean, you probably might have that one guy that brings in 20, pound, 20 pounds. Uh, but the lake is really muddy right now and blown out everywhere. So it could happen. It might not could happen. Who knows? Um, but we're here a little early. So um, we don't have our uh, partners in crime with us this uh, this tournament, Jared and Jace. Uh, Jace has just actually had a baby last night, so congratulations to him. And uh, hopefully he'll be back at Blackshear with us, uh, both of them. But other than that, Justin and I are just kind of chilling here. And uh, we're just going to kind of wait till they call Boat 43 and what Justin usually says is for me to hold on. So, um, of course, we're going to be filming. We're going to be... Uh, Hopefully, uh, it's not supposed to rain today, so we're going to be running the mic today. Hopefully, y'all can hear all, everything. And uh, tomorrow, it's supposed to be really rainy conditions. So, we just got to catch them today because conditions are only going to get tougher tomorrow. So, hopefully, we can go drop a bag today and uh, be, good, be in good standings for tomorrow. So, if y'all haven't already, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Uh, we are pretty close to 700 subscribers. Uh, we actually might be over 700 subscribers by the time this video comes out. But guys, please help me get to a thousand subscribers and get. And uh, we're gonna do that big six cents giveaway, and then we're gonna do a couple other prize packs. So, just some of uh, just some of my favorite baits. Uh, so go ahead and hit that like or hit that subscribe button. So, all right, guys. Well, we're gonna get everything set up, get some rods out, or get some more rods out, and uh, we're gonna get ready for day one. For so, y'all stay tuned. Let's get the fish.
Heck yeah. God dang, you got that white one still tied on. I gotta wait with this frog. Yes. He was he snatched it though. Let him hit it and then wait a couple of seconds. They're eating shad. Hit him. Nope, he didn't. He didn't even have it. I didn't see it though. Oh my God! Somebody give me that damn frog. He had it. God dang it! We got anything on top water besides a buzz bait? I bet you a damn pop R be freaking good. Too much trash in there. Yeah, you're right. God dang. Oh, you know what? I got that swim jig. No, it's a dark one. Oh my God. Got him. Oh, big and big and. Oh my God. Yes. Good job thinking, Bubba. I thought about a damn wife. <laughs>
fish. Net. Yes. He's 14, right? That fish ain't 14. Thank God. Oh, that's number five. We just caught him. Two o'clock. Two o'clock. We got like an hour left to fish. God dang. Fishing is tough, folks. Oh. Let me get him in the live well. Why couldn't we do that all day? Forty-three. Buck forty-three. Buck forty-three. All right, water coming back. Forty-three. Uh, what'd I say? Forty-three. Okay. Five fish, five alive. Ooh, that one got me. Good love. Y'all have to cheat you so much. Okay. That's right, Good bag, though. Yeah. Eleven point two three. Eleven point two three. I thought we had Good job. Uh, you want some? Sure, yeah, why not? Yeah, I mean, at least. Oh, that bag up there. You let Big Daddy catch one? Hell yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys. Pictures, Mom. Good job, man. Good job. Thank y'all. Don't forget your slip. Slip. What's up, guys? All right. So, recap for day one. We uh, lost a bunch on the buzz bait and the frog. Goodness gracious, guys. Uh, it's just like they wouldn't commit to it. And then we'd go in one area and we'd run through it and get a blow up, come back, turn around, come back, and we couldn't get them to buy it. It was like a one and done kind of deal. Um, even when we tried later, like coming back like later in the day, and they still wouldn't, nothing. Um, I think there's like a bite window going on right now. That's what Justin and I kind of determined, and if, uh, or at least there was today. Tomorrow is probably gonna be a whole different story as I don't know if y'all can hear this, but it is raining. Thankfully, we are underneath the shelter. So, yeah, hopefully they'll bite all day tomorrow. Um, it's supposed to be cloudy. There is a shad spawn going on. So, we're trying to take advantage of that. And thankfully, today we did. We caught two on a swim jig. Uh, and finally, like we had like an hour and like 15 minutes and like tw or 20 minutes uh, left to fish today and we managed to catch our fifth limit our fish fit our fifth fish and fill out our limit and we actually had more than we thought we had 11 and a quarter pounds and guys we are sitting ninth right now um so 20 pounds is leading 18 pounds is second 
couple uh like three 16 pound bags 15 a 13 and then us so uh we are two spots out of check range and we are nine pounds out of the lead so we got a big deficit to make up tomorrow um yeah so i mean it's pretty simple all we gotta do is catch 30 pounds tomorrow and hopefully those guys only catch like five or six and yeah and none of the other guys in between us don't catch nothing either so we can do it <laughs> uh it's possible at lake you follow but as for conditions like this i don't think it's gonna happen but we are gonna try to bust another 20 pounds tomorrow i mean we got nothing to lose we're just gonna go out and have fun so um hopefully y'all can hear me so got this mic working out and i think i got it figured out but Justin and I are going to get finished up rigging up rods and rigging up tackle for tomorrow. And uh, guys, thank y'all for watching. And uh, we will see y'all in the morning for day two for the Georgia Bass Trail on Lake Follow. See ya.